Faye Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw the planets in our solar system. So I'm going to come over here on the left hand side and right about here in the cent uh, center of that space I'm going to draw a curve line out, down, over, and connect. And I come right above it and I'm going to draw curve lines and then I'll draw a wavy and then a curve line and then a wavy and a curve line. Keep going, keep going because this is our sun. S U N. Now, we don't have dotted lines in the uh, in outer space, but I'm going to use a dotted line in order to keep my planets equal in the distance. So this first dotted line, I just drew a baby circle, and this is Mercury. M E R C U R Y. Mercury. Now the next planet I'm going to do is Venus. So I come down a little bit and I draw another circle, a little bit bigger. And I can start from the top and bring that dotted line all the way down to Venus. Jump over and bring it in. And that's V-E-N-U-S. Then the third planet is Earth. So I'm going to come above and I'm going to draw a bigger circle and I'm going to add my dotted line, jump over, keep going, and now I'm going to write E-A-R-T-H, Earth. Next, Mars. So I'm going to come up, draw another circle, dotted line, and we're curving it all the way down so that we know that these are the orbits of the planets. And now I'm going to write Mars. M-A-R-S. Okay, the next planet is the big guy of the uh, galaxy. And that is a bigger circle. Add your dotted line. Jump over. And this is Jupiter. J-U-P-I-T-E-R. Now I'm going to come down a little bit and I'm going to draw a medium sized circle. Now watch what I do. I come up on the top and I draw a straight line up, curve line over, straight line down, curve line up, and connect. And this is Saturn. So I'm going to draw my dotted lines. Those are my orbits, remember that. And now I'm going to write Saturn. S-A-T-U-R-N. Okay? Now I go back to littler size circle. Draw my dotted line. And this is Uranus. U-R-A-N-U-S. I'm going to come down right about here and I'm going to draw another smaller circle. Add my dotted line orbit. Keep going. And this is Neptune. N-E-P-T-U-N-E. -E. Now the last one Put a little baby circle, let's put it right here, and this is going to be Pluto. So I come all the way back up and do my orbit, jump over, and now I can write the word Pluto. P-L-U-T-O. Now I know somebody's going to say, hey, Pluto is not a planet. They've been talking about it. I think he, he's not a planet. I say he because 
These are named after the Greek gods. So I will leave it up to whoever's in charge over at your house to let you figure out whether or not Pluto is a planet or not. But I'm going to go ahead and list him because on all the pictures I saw, he was still listed. Okay, let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, there's a lot of double coloring and triple coloring, and the sun is a good example. So this is all yellow, and I made my outside rim try to look like it's exploding because that's what the sun does. Then I come in and I put a little bit of orange because that's also what's going on, and just a touch of red because it's very hot, very fiery. So that is the sun. Next, closest to it comes Mercury, and I'm just going to make this brown for no reason other than I found my brown and did it. And then next to that is Venus, which I'm making pink only because Venus was the goddess of love. So I'm making that one pink. Next comes Earth. On Earth, I did a little bit of Scribble Scrabble green. That's our continents. And then I came back with my blue green, turquoise blue. And I colored it around those greens to make my oceans. Then Mars is always called the red planet, so I made it red. And then my Jupiter kind of the big guy. I put some yellow, put in some orange, just a tad, a little bit of red, again just a little amount, and then I went over everything with my brown. Filled that all in. Okay? Next, Saturn. So I took my yellow and I made my ring. There's more than one, but I took this ring and this part of the planet, made that yellow, and then I just went over this again with my orange. Okay? Uranus, I just did blue. Neptune, I did purple, and Pluto, because I'm not sure about it, I just left it gray. Okay? Now, we have to fill in the background. So using a blue, any blue, this is a cerulean, I'm just going to lightly loop-de-loop -loop around and in between all the planets, all the dotted line orbits, and all of the words. Don't color so hard you lose your planets or you lose your words, because that's not going to do any good, including the orbit lines. So keep it light, but you do have to color the whole thing. Okay? The entire background. All right, and I always tell everybody, if you're coloring so hard, your hand hurts, you're doing it way too hard. Okay, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here's my solar system with all my planets, all labeled with my orbits and um, everything else. Somebody in my audience, check me on Pluto. You guys are real good about telling me when I make a mistake. So let me know if Pluto is a planet or is it not. Okay. Bye-bye.